Hi guys, welcome back to The Infected. I'm Shy, and I'm checking my uh, stones here real quick. And then I will uh, get you guys up to speed on what I've been doing, what I want to do today. Okay, so I have been able to make two more uh, over here. I have been able to make two more wind turbines and one solar panel. Now I'd like to get another wind turbine up. Um, and that's why you've seen the silhouette sitting up there. Uh, I'd like to get one more wind turbine up. And next thing I want to work on, which I've already placed down the blueprint here, is, let me show you is the oil extractor. Now this thing is not cheap. It takes 15 aluminum, six mechanical parts, six steel ingots, and 20 screws. Now the screws aren't a problem. I have to make up the steel ingots, uh, which shouldn't be a problem. Aluminum I might have. I don't think I have the mechanical parts. Let's go take a look. No, I have no mechanical parts. So if we look, Itempedia, uh, where is it? Is it this one maybe? Okay, yeah, mechanical parts. So we only need one iron ingot on the advanced workbench to make the mechanical parts. So that's doable. I should have plenty of iron to do that. Let's just go ahead and I'm gonna hit H to discard all the sand and then right click to take all the iron fragments. Now this is, or sorry, I think that was, yeah, that was right click. This one is full. So I have started working on this one here, filling it up. So we have plenty of iron at the moment. Um, I have started clearing some of these out and turning them into ingots and putting them up here on shelves. This guys took me forever. <laughs> Um, the, the nails weren't bad since I got the iron coming in. It was the planks. The planks took forever. Um, they are 15 planks each. So that was, uh, quite a task. Um, I, as you can see, I have very little aluminum. Um, I haven't put any steel in though. I did go ahead and make the shelves for it and a little bit of lead, not a ton. So yeah, we're, we're kind of. You, you can see where the abundance is. The abundance is in the iron and the copper. Um, so, yeah, that's what we're working with. Um, I probably... Let's see if I have enough to finish this off real quick. Ten aluminum. I don't know if I have ten aluminum up there. Four iron, five lead, four cobalt. Okay. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, it was four. Yes, I think one, two, three, four. No copper. Two, three, four iron and five lead. I am surprised I'm not overweight, to be honest with you. Okay, so that finishes that one off. We can now move that one outside. Um, I need an extra 100 power to run that oil extractor. That oil extractor I need to be able to make plastic. Um, plastic is used to uh, make... Um, what are those parts called? Electrical parts. <laughs> I'm just kind of lining these up as close as I can. There we go. So that that is complete. Now we got to work on getting this oil extractor made and getting it powered. Um, that that is the next big big task. So. 20 screws I could do. Let's 15 aluminum. Do I have 15? 
I think I have exactly 15. Okay, so we're going to take all that. We're going to fire up the forge here. Uh, that has no fuel in it. We'll fix that. Okay, so now we need... We needed screws. I got 49 screws, so that shouldn't be a big deal. Get those screws in there. And now we need to make six steel. Now, in order to make steel, you need six iron and six lead. There we go. And on the anvil, you just combine those together. Oh, I guess I can hit the... I keep forgetting that uh, repeat last button is in there. So, those are ready for to go in the forge. And then we need six iron ingots to turn into mechanical parts, which is not a big deal. You know what? We got to cook the steel anyway, so we'll, we might as well just throw some iron in there. Probably cut one, two, three, four. Uh, there we go. That looks about right. All right, so let's take these out. We are going to put the other aluminum in. We are going to put that steel in. Okay, now it's been a, a while, guys, since I've played, so I can't remember. I'm going to try. I can't remember if I can connect a new wire straight from this box to the oil extractor. That is my hope, that I can just wire it straight to. Now, like I said, it's been a while since i played, um, so I can't remember if I'm going to need a relay or if I can just connect that straight in. I'm just going to keep that going as much as I can. I just keep running back and forth, checking on my stone extractors, checking on my other extractors. That, that. So yeah, you've not been missing out on a whole lot. This is a lot of of grindy work um for sure i've got four four extractors up now i'm not sure if you guys were here for the last one or not um i'm being impatient as i got two rock extractors as well i'm i'm just i don't have the patience to sit and wait and wait and wait which unfortunately is part of the grind you just you, you gotta wait um all right, let's see. We've got one piece of copper, two cobalt, and one aluminum. This aluminum just goes so fast. All right, we're going to take that. We're going to put this in. Now, what do I want to do after the oil extractor? That's a good question. Do we have enough power? That I didn't even look. That should give me enough power. I do not have enough power. Holy heck. Uh, this is going to be a problem. I thought for sure. Right now it's raining, so we have pretty much no solar power. Um, the wind is way, way down, so we have no wind power. Guys, this power is an issue. What are we going to do? Uh, I don't know. Let's look here. Oh, the batteries take aluminum too. Uh, 
that that's the main reason why I wanted the oil pump was because we need those electrical parts so we can start getting some battery storage. Um, unfortunately, that looks like it's going to be a big issue as to, well, it is, it is nine o'clock in the evening. So I guess there is, we, we do have that as an issue. All right, let's take these out. We're going to put this out. We're going to put the last steel in there and then we are going to make six mechanical parts. All right. We're just going to put this oil pump. Okay, we'll put the extra iron away up here. Okay. Well, let's sleep through the night and see how our power does once we wake up. Hopefully it won't be as big of an issue as it is right now. I didn't realize it was so late in the day, but apparently it is. So we're going to take a little nap. We're going to wait until probably 7 a.m. I think should give it. All right. Now time for my morning routine. I need to eat. Uh, find some food here. There we go. And a drink of water. Should be good. I just save real quick. All right. The rain is dying down. So that's a good sign. So hopefully the sun will come out here just shortly. Um, Yeah, this is off. The power went down enough that it could not uh, even power the stone grinder throughout the night. So, <clears throat> excuse me. The power is coming up. It's at 166 and climbing. Okay, so let's give it a few and see how that does. We won't turn it on yet. Um, <clears throat> goodness grief, <laughs> I apologize. Let's get our wiring, uh, equipment here. I, I, I did that all wrong. There we go. We'll grab some wire. All right, so number four, let's see if we can... Pull, we can, and then connect. Okay, so that should now be connected. Um, let's put our, oh my goodness. Let's see here now. Okay, so yeah, these take 100 each. They're both connected. I need... Hmm. Oh, we're up to 192, so that's good. We're and we're still climbing. So we might be able to reach 200. I think I am going to need more power. There's just nothing else. Are we going to be able to get it? We're so close. Oh, there it is. 200. All right, I'm afraid to turn it on. Is it gonna get any higher than 200? It's not, it's literally stopping at 200. But look at this wind, guys. This wind is the lowest I've seen at 
So as if we start getting more wind, it, it would be much better, but 7.5 is not great. It is enough to turn us on, but for how long, I'm not sure. Um, good grief. Yeah, that's going to be... That's going to be an issue. So I'm thinking we're going to need at least another solar panel, maybe a couple more wind turbines. And obviously my aluminum situation is hurting. Um, we have three here, one downstairs. That's not even enough to do. Uh, let's keep our eye out. Let's see if we can get enough to get another solar panel. We'll just put it up here. We have the, we don't have the aluminum. We have the iron. We have the copper. We have the cobalt. Let's go ahead and stick that in. Okay, I think it's four of each on those. Five iron. We got that. All right, now we got to get some aluminum. Let's go check on the extractors and see if they have put anything out yet. All right. Oh, we do have one. Okay, perfect. Okay, so we've got one in there. Oh, more. I'm so happy when I come in here and I see aluminum. Like, that is the best thing ever for me. And the oil pump is running. Let's see. I don't know. I'm guessing it's every five minutes. I didn't look when it started. And then it'll produce one can of oil. So, guys, this thing's got to be running pretty much non-stop. Um, let's get our aluminum out. Mm. I think that's 10 pieces. Let me put this wiring away. And we will also trade these back out. Maybe. <laughs> I have such a hard time with that. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, that's enough for a full. And then we could throw the others on the shelves as soon as they're done. But yeah, it's just, that's, that's been my process. It's like, I, I always need something and I'm always running back and forth, filling things up, taking stuff out, refueling. It's, it's pretty much nonstop here at the base, just trying to get, uh, things going for, for power. And this is just the beginning of the power guys. This isn't even... Like, I have s such a far way to go. I am going to want to get, eventually, this oil pump. This oil pump will run my extractors for me without having to need the biofuel. But it is 20 mechanical parts, 20 electrical parts, 50 iron ingots, 20 steel ingots, and it takes 150 power by itself to run. And this thing is massive. So that is my, I would say, long-term goal um, is to be getting that up so that I don't have to keep relying on biofuel. Right now, my biofuel is still doing okay, but it's definitely went down significantly. It was, I had a complete row full. So we're going through more biofuel than what I can, I've been able to produce. So that's uh that's fun all right let's oh why am i doing that i can just take all okay let's get this stuff in this this guy here what oh yeah that's right i had some over here okay i'm like freaking out i was like no i have enough okay i do have enough and then i think i had one copper okay yeah all right, let's take this guy outside, line him up with the other ones, 
and hopefully that will give us another boost of power but i really think that i am going to need to put up more wind turbines um in the long run And these are great and all, but yeah, they are kind of a, a pain. I mean, I didn't realize how bad. Oh, I hear a hog. Where are you at? Um, I didn't realize how low the wind could get. I thought I heard that guy somewhere. Oh, there he is. Excuse me. I need you. All right. Got some. I have been trying to get all the animals that I hear. I'm, I'm not chasing down chickens right now, but trying to get these animals so that I can keep the biofuel going. Um, don't taunt me. I have an extra cart. Now the thing with the deer is if I shoot him, he's not going to die right away. And I'm going to have to watch where he goes so that I can drop him. Alright, let's see. Come on, guy. Get out from behind the trees. Oh, there's another one. Oh my good grief. Okay. He's going that direction. Where did he go? I hope he did not fall in the water. Holy crap, that's a bear. Oh my gosh. Why are you guys making my life so difficult? I already have a bear on my table. Okay, um, I don't even see where that deer went. Knowing my luck, it fell in the flipping water. Yeah, I hear you, buddy. Run! Oh gosh, he's so fast. Where's he at? Ah! Get off me! No! I need my spear. Hey, dude, get off my truck. Ooh. Wow. That was, uh... That was a little scary. Not gonna lie. Ooh. Alright, let's get, let's get the bear as well. Why not? I've got some animals to slaughter, it looks like. Um... I lost the deer at this point. I don't, I, I'm, I'm not really, I don't care. <laughs> he can, he can go. He can have my arrow. I, my bet is he, he died, but I can't, uh, I, I don't, I didn't see where he died at. So we're just going to have to, uh, let him be. Look at all this food on the ground. I want all of this. Oh my gosh. That's going to help me with biofuel as well. All right, guys, let's go and see how much power we have now that I have uh, been able to. That doesn't need to be in there. Now that I've been able to put that other solar panel up, let's have a look. 240 okay so still not great when the sun goes down that's gonna drop quite a bit and i'm not gonna be able to run both machines so uh what is i i i've got to keep working on power off camera i've got to um try to sleep through the night as much as possible that way i can keep the solar panels running um, how much oil do we have? I'm guessing we only have... Oh, we have two. So I don't know if I was just gone in long, long enough for it to do two, or if it does two every five minutes. 
I'm not sure. Anyway, guys, thanks for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Leave me a like if you did. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't had a chance already. And until next time, guys, I'll see you later.